The bigger theme of Extraordinary is really about the tremendous contribution that Nancy Horton makes uh, in the life of Dave and the rest of the family. He's been gifted with the ability to run, 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 run. So that is what he's doing. Meanwhile, the wife is at home taking care of the home and she's missing him. Your kids are growing up right in front of you and you're missing it. But when you actually look at the story, you realize, wow, it's about Nancy and everything that she, like, this is an amazing woman. You know, Nancy is the wife to David Horton. I think she is really uh, the glue that holds everything together. She is this one that is the, the cheerleader. Uh, she is the one that is this true partner to Dave and who really is the one that's standing behind him to pursue his passions. His responsibility in his marriage, you know, love, love your wife like Christ loved the church. Okay, well that means even though I have two days left and I'm just about to finish this dream, I will give it all up because this is also a response to, to God. Your family, they seem like something to run to. As she goes through and then she becomes a wife and a mother and she really starts to identify more with being at home with her kids and kind of losing this connection with her husband. And so we get to go on this journey of what it really looks like and I think that so often is what happens in marriages. God intervenes as he always does and then there's a change that takes place. Maybe Dave is giving you everything that he can give you right now. But what if it's not enough? And when did serving God become not serving your family? You took vows, Nat, before family, friends, and God. That's what you stand on. 